Am I the asshole? For telling my father it's none of his damn business if I want to lie in bed the entire weekend? I 26 work full-time on Friday and pay all the bills for my own apartment. I enjoy spending my entire weekend lying in bed watching Netflix, scrolling TikTok, or just napping. I absolutely admit this isn't a very productive way to spend my time, however my bills are paid, my apartment is tidy and I have no outstanding errands, therefore it's harming no one if I choose to stay in bed. My father rang me this afternoon on WhatsApp and saw that I was still lying in bed, in my pajamas at 4 p.m. He started making little digs saying good evening and asking me what I've done all day. I told him absolutely nothing, to which he said it was ridiculous that I felt it was acceptable to laze about in bed all day to which I responded that it is none of his damn business if I want to lie in bed all weekend and abruptly ended the call. I feel I'm in the right but my aunt and best friend seems to think I'm the ah. Uh. Am I the asshole Reddit? Not the asshole. Sometimes you don't want to do anything lol. Sounds like my standard weekend to be honest lol. Not the asshole. You're a grown up. Do whatever makes you happy. Nope. Not the asshole. Dad doesn't pay your bills, dad doesn't get a say in how you spend your days off. He can have his opinion, but he gets to keep it to himself. Not the asshole. I always think it's amazing how some parents continue to psychologically harm their children as adults lol. Live your fucking life, boomer. Some of us work hard, make good money, and don't have any children to chase after and it's awesome. Not the asshole god I wish I could this more often. You lays in bed all you want, how you spend your time is your business. Dollar the haters. Not the asshole. How you spend your free time is absolutely your own choice. Not the asshole. The perks of being an adult is you get to decide what to do with your free time. Unless your dad would like to start telling him what he is doing wrong in his life, he needs to knock it off. Not the asshole extroverts are always trying to get introverts to be extroverts like them. Stop it just stop it. Not the asshole if you work, pay bills, and live on your own then do you. Live your bliss. Not the asshole. His opinion would only be valid if you lived with him and you weren't keeping up with your share of household chores. But you live on your own, so you don't owe anyone an explanation. You work full time. Your place is clean. You make yourself food and buy your own groceries. All the bills are current. You're an adult with no other responsibilities. He is the ah here. If you had children or other obligations you were blowing off I would say you're the ah, but you don't. You have done all you needed to do. I'm sure if there was something else you were supposed to be doing you would be. Not the asshole, your time is your own and how you spend it is up to you, as long as all of your necessities are handled I don't see a problem. Not the asshole. It's 5.27 p.m. here, and that's exactly what I'm doing right now. Not the asshole, that's exactly my weekends. Not the asshole, you can do whatever the hell you want and it's an asshole move by your father to shame you for how you spend your time. Not the asshole, what you do in your free time is your business. Sounds like you are a responsible person. He was being very rude. I gotta wonder, what exactly is he doing to save the world in his free time? Not the asshole. You can do with your time whatever the hell you want with your time, staying in bed included. You're an adult. Your dad is way overstepping boundaries. Not the asshole. Now that I have my kids, it's a dream to do exactly what you're doing. Live it up and regret nothing. Not the asshole all due respect what's it to do with anyone how you spend your free time? Bills? Done. Errands? Done. If your mental health needs the break, take the break. Enjoy. Not the asshole you live your best sedentary life. Not the asshole. It's not his business and you can live your life how you want to. That's what's so lovely about being young, independent, and free of commitments. You might not be able to do this one day so enjoy it now, smiley face. Not the asshole. You live on your own. You are a fully grown human. Take advantage of your don't call it lazy, it's not relaxing weekend. We need to stop glorifying busy and start glorifying self-care. You are doing it right. Not the asshole. You have a full-time job, you pay all your own bills, you have your own place and it is kept tidy. I see absolutely nothing wrong with wanting to lounge around on the weekends if you don't have anything else to do. It's your life and you get to choose how to spend your downtime days off. Not the asshole. That's the beauty of being an adult. Good for you. Not the asshole. I do technically the same thing during my off days and it's completely okay. 
it'd be different if you were dependent on him, but you're a completely independent person. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. Dad should mind his own business. His little girl has grown up. Maybe you should think about avoiding communicating with him when you want privacy. He needs to be reminded that you are an adult in a more passive way. Be happy. If laying around is what is it, then do it as much as it takes. Not the asshole he can make demands on your time when he puts you in payroll. Not the asshole fuck no do whatever you want. End of discussion. Not the asshole. I'll give him the benefit of the doubt by saying he's probably just worried and is probably aware that lying in bed all day can be a sign of depression and whatnot. Your reaction was probably justified though by how he chose to voice it. Not the asshole you should absolutely do whatever you want during the weekend. Your father does not need to worry about you if you're just relaxing at home. That being said, maybe hanging up abruptly was the rude part and that's what your aunt and friend were referring to. I'd, but either way they can shove it as well. If my husband and I didn't have kids this is what we'd do. Nta. Asking loads of people with no hobbies who watch Netflix all day if watching Netflix all day is okay. Not the asshole, you don't depend on them to finance your life so the way you live it is up to you and not them. I mean, I do that on the weekends too but my apartment sure isn't tidy and I'm definitely ignoring errands. If you're bringing in the money, you can sleep till 4, honey. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. What is it our parents used to say? My roof, my rules. When you pay the bills you can do whatever you want. All you are doing is what they said. Good dads are concerned about their kids and feels obliged to ask if everything is okay. Not the asshole. My wife and I usually both spend our days off in bed. Our work days are mentally strenuous and we make it a point to do things like run errands on the way home from work. We clean up behind ourselves as we go so we rarely have much if anything to tidy unless one of the dogs have an accident. Every other week or so we have a date night and go do something for a couple hours but the second we're home the street clothes come off the comfies go on and we get back to relaxing. Some people just don't get it. Not the asshole. If you've got a clean place and no outstanding tasks, you're doing better than most and can spend your free time doing whatever the hell you want. Life doesn't have to be 100 grind. Not the asshole. You're obviously being productive enough during the week to live independently and have earned the right to do or not do whatever you choose on the weekends. Even God for those who believe took a day off. Not the asshole. It's your free time, not his. I'm a dad, and I want to defend your dad here for just wanting what's best for you, but he kinda blew it by being a jerk. You're an adult, you're living on your own, your life's in order, you can do whatever the fuck you want on the weekend. I totally understand your dad wanting to encourage you to get out, maybe meet some people and have adventures, but he did it in an abusive way. There are more constructive ways to communicate than calling you ridiculous and lazy. A dad should always be supportive and seek to build you up, not tear you down. 100 Not the asshole. Took me until I was 30 with a push from my husband to finally take a nap during the day due to shitty parents that thought any napping was indicative of laziness. Ta. Not the asshole that said, I'd wonder if my daughter was sick or depressed or had some other issue that kept her in bed. But I would say that instead of criticizing. Not the asshole what do your aunt and best friend expect you to do? Live under your father's control still? Live by your father's or their values? Put up with your father rudely judging how you spend your days off when you aren't doing what he approves of, as if you were still a minor? Not the asshole. You're a functioning adult who takes care of all their responsibilities that would be different if you didn't but chose to lay in bed all weekend. Nta. If I want to be fat and lazy on my days off, I will. Not the asshole you're hurting nobody. If that's how you enjoy your downtime, have it it. Not the asshole power move start telling him how sorry you are that he can't enjoy any downtime. Not the asshole. My bill is like this. Like damn dude, are you allergic to relaxing? He always has to be doing something, it's exhausting to be in his presence. Not the asshole every dad around our parents' ages is like this, they can't fathom not spending all time working on some project or extra task, when not working or doing essential errands during the weeks I tried to explain to my dad multiple times that it'd come about getting a bunch of random stuff done, as long as essentials are good and my place isn't covered in trash then I'm good, but he gets on me for being in my bed or not changing out of sleeping clothes stay strong. The older people will stick together and I'd what's up with your best friend, but you aren't the asshole. Are Not the asshole. So what's he accomplished on his weekends has he cured cancer? Brought us world peace? 
Didn't think so. Not the asshole. I think it's interesting that many of the YTA and ESH are criticizing what you do to chill and claiming that you must be depressed. Would the reaction be the same if you said you like to lay around and read in your pajamas all weekend because you don't have time to read a book during your very busy and active work week? Would your father have been okay with it if you said you were reading a very good book? Not the asshole. I do this once a month. Completely switch off and veg out for a weekend. As you said, your job is physical and you have no outstanding tasks. Why the hell not? Not the asshole. Not how I would have handled it. If my dad asked my 24-year-old self why I was in bed at 4 p.m. I'd have said well. It's not like I'm alone. I Info. How long have you been doing this? Weeks? Months? Years? Not the asshole but sometimes it's better to just deflect what family members say rather than respond to it. But I don't know your dad so maybe he kept digging. I'm on vacation in Italy and doing the same thing. Rest is important. Your values are your own. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. Sounds like a typical dad. Time to stop being so honest with him, it's not his business how you're spending your time. Not the asshole. Like you said, you're covering your own expenses. It's no one's business how you choose to spending your free time. Not the asshole. You're an adult and how you choose to spend your time outside of work is up to you. So whether it's productive or not is none of his business. As long as you're happy and not depressed I wouldn't see this as a problem. But I get where someone would see this as a waste of time or unfulfilled to them. Sometimes I work 13 days in a row and if I stay in bed for 30 minutes after waking up it just feels like a waste. Not the asshole, and I will literally die on this hill. You are asking us if you are the off or trying to prepare for the next 5 days of the week, which can be mentally draining tbh. You are an adult who is on their feet and not struggling, so you should take the opportunity to rest up. Your father needs to have faith in his child, if he believes he has raised them right.